off the comments with, with uh young felicia man that is hilarious why'd y'all turn off the cop y'all let me know down below why y'all think they turned off the comments man oh god 2k lab man they done did it some part gameplay bro they done turned up the brightness why does the brightness look better <laughs> y'all let me know which version looks better to y'all the the more darker or the more brightness that's crazy I really wish 2K would uh take out the shadows or give us an option to turn them off. I hear they do that in other games. Now look, retired young Jack Bill, man, he tweets out, the color red is commonly used in marketing and is known to make people impulsively spend money. Receptors in the brain. <laughs> it's not capping, y'all. A lot of y'all y'all might think it's stupid, but you don't really know. Certain colors play a lot to how you can feel certain ways. Backed by science. And now NBA 2K25 is doing it. Ruby badges tapping in, guys. You clowns are all falling for it, but I didn't expect less. Hey, more smiley face. You're spinning on a player for an annual release. Look, guys, I'm giving you pro tips, bro. When you create your builds, the people that should be shooting for the red badges, they should be the more talented players. Know yourself. If you're not too good at the game, don't be shooting for the red badges unless you're just trying to have fun or whatever. But when you be shooting for them red badges, dog, it's going to make your build less all around, right? When you play with randoms or you're an npc you need to be more all around and have some size to you right but if you're a skilled meta guy and you got a team you got people that could cover up your weaknesses when you don't have no one that could cover up your weaknesses then you shouldn't be aiming for those type of badges right okay i know they hyping up the small builds too but again you are not a skilled talented player know yourself you need to be making a bigger type of build you know so you can have more fun and all this and that please you negative win percent stop making small guards y'all y'all still been doing it all these years you have no arsenal of dribble moves you can't score off the dribble know yourself bro you feel me or learn how to play i hate going in the red there's a pg who don't know how to use his right stick he just panic pass the ball every time he don't even use his right stick he just pass 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 pass, pass. he has no scoring ability guys that's that's not how you run main ball handler bro you got to be a threat. If you can't be a threat, stop making little guards, please. Know your place in this world. Life is all about knowing yourself. A young germ, man, he tweets out, uh, Caitlin Clark, you know, compared to real life, does this look real to y'all? Real look more explosive. I ain't gonna hold you. Damn, Mike Wayne, why we, uh, why in the video game are we less explosive? Why do we keep catering to them? Negative win percent. <laughs> this is Angel Reach jump shot compared to IRL, okay? um it looked like her hand still on it is it still on it it kind of don't be on it like that for this one mm. they probably got a different animation maybe she did it wrong or different ways but a lot of people were roasting her for not having a real jump shot. look this went hella viral 4.5 million views right look he's saying this is obvious game footage because no way angel reese shoots something from beyond the paint flaming this is why 2k is so garbage never believe animations angel would never make a jump shot in real life it made her shot prettier than it is yeah but they they roast now look they switched up the builder a little bit for the uh six one height and six seven wingspans man ain't nothing too serious look we got some cross launch comparisons um 2k lab y'all need to do a comparison of the wnba someone make a wnba comparison right because since they're little they dribble different and it's a different mode different badges someone should get this girl and do it in the mode and compare it like that y'all let me know what y'all notice this one seemed a little bit more wider hopefully it is like that this one seems like you got to be more angled but yeah now look double h tweets this out y'all let me know why y'all think he tweeted this out man I did some digging to find out how much VC it costs to upgrade it to 85 overall in the last 10 years. Why only 85 overall? Why not to 99? I mean, like, why? I don't know what he's really trying to convey. And he's trying to, I don't know if he's trying to make it seem closer than it really is for some reason. I don't know. I don't know if we kind of defend that VC prices, but everybody know after the 85, like, it matters more. I'm pretty sure in past 2Ks, couldn't even buy your way through i think like after 85 and then the journey between the 85 to 99 it wasn't as expensive a lot of these 2ks especially the later ones 
it was hidden how much you're spending like they would make it seem like oh like oh you're not spending that much like oh like right when you upgrade to 85 but then it's more expensive on the other half that people can't keep up with because they can't do it all at once like you only get little by little so you're not keeping track like say oh like you broke a cap right you only spend 7k to upgrade and then a couple days later break another cap over and over again so you're not keeping track but the 80 to the 85 you can keep track so they get us like that and people don't understand how much they were actually spending and also in um the past 2ks you could earn vc way easy clothes weren't as expensive so many things they weren't as expensive it was a way cheaper game to play even though the vc prices stayed the same that doesn't really mean like it wasn't way cheaper to play the game and to earn vc etc they really nerfed a lot of things man and a lot more other things became way more expensive it's a huge difference y'all let me know why y'all think double h only showed it to 85 kind of strange now look at this man power df for some reason why are why are these tweets like around the same time i don't understand i don't know people trying to get um logos or or what but it's weird timing man but look 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 what he's saying guys why why do y'all allow this it's time we tell the truth builds in 2k actually aren't more expensive and it's actually cheaper than it was six years ago. he's saying six years vc prices haven't changed since nba 2k 17 still cost the same amount of vc to reach an 85 overall rating again that doesn't matter because the 85 through 99 is really where they really get you but money is worth less now due to inflation about 30 percent less so guess what buddy if i make 70k a year and everything else is just getting more expensive that means it's more expensive man I, it doesn't if everything in life is getting more expensive and my the income i'm making isn't risen and everything's getting more expensive it is more expensive You're paying the same number of dollars for vc cap well 99 is more expensive well no it's not nba 2k 18 and 19 you couldn't even buy 99 it's next doesn't that make it cheaper and in 2k 20 you had to keep playing to get 99 and could lose it so you might actually never reach guys y'all know how much clothes is all this and that it's it's really sad man why even make this post though i don't get it and i remember in 23 bro there was like 400k plus 500k plus to really get your build to 99 it wasn't like that back then i mean I just don't get it, bro. Like, well, these guys do these things to get logos. Why do y'all let this go on? I, I don't, I don't understand. Do y'all not understand? Like, them doing that makes it harder for you to get a game, like a better game in the future. Look at this, offending clothes, bro. Higher, higher, higher power, guys. Why do y'all let this stuff? Like, this community is so weak, bro. <laughs> but y'all want to get on my head for roasting people, man. Bro, I, I'm the toxic guy. He sold his soul to 2K. Power don't realize if the game was cheaper and we all came together to just flame and attack, the game was cheaper, more people would play. That means more viewership for you. It's hurting you to defend 2K all for a logo. Crazy, dog. Why do y'all, bro, I just, y'all, this community is so, bro, is slobbering on it. My goodness, you a part of the problem? Okay, some of y'all is, but, but it gotta be long term. Like, y'all can't, y'all can't let people get away with this stuff. Like, there has to be, like, you know, like, I don't know, bro. Y'all are tripping, bro. It's, uh, hey, young soft drink trying to bring back NFL 2K. I am in support of this. Y'all should uh tweet this out because competition breeds better games. Little B is going to be a playable character. I don't know if this is for my team. Y'all let me know if y'all care about that. Oh, look, look at this. Look. Look at this. This. Heard him. This is a fight. He's a bully, bro. Now, look, bro. This is a fight. You know, he wouldn't do this to someone his size, right? This is a fight. You don't do this. This rarely happened. This is why I was so against brick wall in the game, dog. Like nobody's brick walling people and it's not a fight, dog. Like, but I mean, that that guy's unconscious. So I mean, I don't think he gonna be able to get up and fight. I'm pretty sure this is fake. Y'all let me know if y'all agree with him being 75 overall. I don't know why Drew Holiday got his mouth open like this. 2K is doing him bad with these weird comparisons. I don't know why, uh, very strange. I don't know. With me today is Felicia Steenhouse, the senior producer on The W in NBA 2K25. Welcome, Felicia. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to talk The W with you. I'm excited to talk about The W as well. Let's talk about the WNBA season that's still going on right now. So many great games right now. Today, we'll be diving into... Oh, man. 
I don't really know what was going on. I guess some people was trying to pull back MW2 in some way. I thought the old servers were open. I don't know. Maybe this is some different way. But uh, 2K or not 2K. Activision sent some cease and desist and they got to shut it down because they scared of it affecting their real numbers. Guys, and this is an example of the reason they don't keep the servers open is because they know people won't buy the new product. They won't be able to make more money overall. That's with all games because they know that old product could be way better. You know, they're scared. But I, someone explained it to me. Uh, I thought like older games were open. Maybe not this one. Anywho, y'all click on the video on the screen if you want to see why I quit NBA 2K. Done. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.